44 Herblow Gang, that's not a flex. Trust me. It's, it's not a flex to... It, did you know what that's the equivalent to? Saying 44 Herblow Gang is equivalent to having a sticker on the fucking back of your car that says, My son, or I, my superpower is loving a child with autism. That is exactly what that fucking flex is right there, Mr. Green's mean green bean machines. Play the fucking game. Alright, guys, seeds, farming, one of the worst skills in the game, you guys know me, I'm not a farming fan, but we're going to do this tier list today, it's going to be legitimate, it's going to be straight from the words, or the mouths, sorry, the mouths of Jagex and their old school RuneScape employees, Mod Ash has had a large amount of input into this tier list, but as we know, my say is final, no matter what you say, or what you believe, I'm the fucking king, and I'm the one that's bringing you this information today. I will be putting a link in the description when I re-upload this as a video, so that if you are watching this as a as a replay, you can just skip to the end of the summary if you are a piece of shit. But I'm going to litter it with ad revenue. Therefore, when you watch the replay and you skip, you'll be making me a lot of money. So watch the whole video instead. Don't be a fucking piece of shit, and turn your ad blocker off. Everyone in the stream, though, thank you. I appreciate you guys being here. Your champions. It's uh it's early on a Tuesday. It's eight in the afternoon. I haven't had any alcohol yet, but I've had a bit of Pepsi Max. My dick is hard. And we're going to start off with the the original, the, the OG seed. The first one we all start with, the potato seeds. Alright? Potato seeds are pretty, uh... They're pretty fucking useless. There's no debating it. They're immediately F tier seeds. Because I'm 90% sure you just skip potatoes anyway, right? You do some sort of quest, or you do something, and you don't even have to touch potato seeds ever. Um... I haven't got a use for potatoes at all. The potato food you can just buy, they're, they're, they're useless. They're pointless, they don't get XP, they're just everywhere, and they're the most commonly deleted fucking seed in the game, closely followed by onions. These seeds are also F tier, okay? We have S tier for short? No. Not even for the meme, it's not even funny. Stop suggesting stupid shit, okay? Potato and onion seeds are always F tier. There's no debating it. Unless you're telling me you, you value potato seeds, do you actually farm potatoes past level fucking 4 farming? You don't. Okay? You don't. I don't do them anymore. You don't. Can I move this fucking onion cunt? They're terrible. Terrible seeds that don't need to belong in the game. They're, they're never used. They're just annoying. They're in the way. When you pick a farmer's fucking pocket, alright? You just, you're just, you're just disappointed with the results. Also, I'm, I was hoping I'd get to see you die, uh, do Jad and die, John Doe. You've got a nice head. Okay, next seed. What are these? Sweet corn. Now, sweet corn seeds are a little bit better, okay? Why? Because I do sweet corn sometimes. Uh, they give a moderate amount of XP for allotments. It's low, but it's useful. I think corn is used for something. I don't know what. I actually don't know what corn is used for. King has S seed, uh, S tier seed. <coughs> yes, I do. So, I think corn... Um, what is corn even used for? I don't know what corn's used for, but it's used for something. Anubis wanted it. Maybe for potatoes. I'm going to make it a D tier corns. Because I farm them quite a bit and I like it. Their seeds I would keep. Tuna potatoes. It's better than normal potatoes. I will actively farm corn if I don't have strawberries or watermelons or, or snake grass. So corns get D tier because they are somewhat at least used. Which uh, brings me to what... What seeds are these? What's this one here? This one is a curry seed. Curry seeds. Okay. Um. What? Does anyone actually make curry in game? Has anyone ever made curry in, in RuneScape? Like the stream if you've never made curry in RuneScape. If you've never made curry, hit the like button right now. Potato seeds are, and onions even look like Master Farmer sacks because of how bad they are. That's toxic. But yes. I'm going to tell you right now, no one's ever made curries in RuneScape. You've done curry trees, because they give good XP. That's why they're getting E. But you've never used curry leaf. You've never used them. You, you, you catch a, an eclectic impling, you get a curry leaf, you put it on the ground, you walk away very fucking fast. You don't look back. Curry trees, curry seeds are all useless. The only good thing about them is the XP, until you can start doing pineapple. That's the only reason you do curry. 
Okay, there's nothing else with them. Cummy trees. Now you see that'd be different. That would be S tier, but there is no cummy tree, unfortunately. You got these. The uh, what are these fucking called? Nastur, 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 Nasturitarium, Nasturitum, Nasturitid, Nasturiti, um, Nasturitum, Nasturitium. Nasty ass seeds. That's what these are. No one. I've I've pickpocketed many of these. Uh, na nastru nas nastru nasturishim. What what is what is that? What is it? I've never planted one. They're nasty. I think that's the, the what you have to take away from the name. Nasturshrooms. Fuck off. That says nasturshrooms. You're pulling my dick. That is not- is that nasturtium? Is that how you pronounce that? Fuck the English language is weird. These are F tier. Fuck those seeds. I've never seen- why would you plant them? It's a flower seed, uh, that isn't white lilies or limpwort. That's fair. Yeah? Barry Sablo, what's up, brother? I could never read it because I'm dick lick sick. Yes. Dick lick yes. Yes, same. <laughs> they prevent watermelons and strawberries from getting diseased. Okay, they seem pretty fucking useless then. What are these? White lilies. Now, people say white lilies are good seeds. Um, I've never used white lilies in my life. I I, I don't know. I'm, I'm new to the iron... you got to be pulling my dick hole that I'm getting messages while I'm streaming. Get the fuck out of here now, cunt. Fuck off. Get out of here. Sorry. White lily seeds. I've never used them in my life. Apparently they're good. Use white lily to make the best Groot. And that's it. White lily is, ju is just for... As in white lily seed or white lily the flower? What, what, do, you, what do you use white lily for? Never... I don't, I don't know. This is nothing. Seeds so far are not looking very good on this list. They protect all allotment patches. Protect snake grass. Okay, they can go D tier. Because I don't see myself... Growing snake grass, except unless it's in the farming guild, I'm not going to grow snake grass anywhere else. I know it's efficient to do every patch, but I just do corrend and I'm happy with that. So, D tier for those because that sounds pretty important at the same time. Other than that, teak. Oh, teak seeds. I didn't know these were teak. Okay, teak seeds. I like teak seeds because they will give you teak trees, and teak trees, I think on for on, on Fossil Island are good. That's about it. Teak trees are getting, or teak seeds are getting B tier because they're shit to grow, but they're useful when grown. B tier, I agree. Yeah, B tier, teak. I don't think there's any debating that. Teak trees are somewhat useful and, and valuable. Even though they take a while to grow, they're not a complete fucking disappointment. Just like anyone in the stream right now who hasn't actually pressed the like button, you are a disappointment. You see another white lily tango root? I'll catch fire. Are they, is that, are they that popular, are they? What are these pink ones? What are these? Grapes. I've never planted grape. Can you? I've never planted grapes. But I did need a Anubis did them for me once, and it was good because that way I could get cooking up. So I'm gonna make grapes B tier as well. They seem useless for one, after a very certain part of the game, you know. What's up, Bill Blow? How we doing, brother? I think grapes can go B tier because they yeah they they have a limited use. White Lily group, best group. Okay. Maybe we can debate that later. They got their own place in Hossid. You can make them Zami grapes or some shit. Okay. They can go B tier because I've used them recreationally. I'm a disappointment. How embarrassment? Yes, you are. But it's okay. Alright. Um, oh, where's acorns? I want to do acorns. Who made this tier list? There's no acorns on here. They didn't do acorns. They did do acorns. Where's acorn? They're, oh, there. I'm autistic. Acorns. Um, acorns are F tier. That's guaranteed. That's that's a no-brainer. That's why I wanted to get them out of the way. Oak trees are the worst fucking tree to grow. They suck. What the hell is this? It's a tier list, cunt. Dude, could, have, you, have you not been on the internet for the past fucking eight years? Have you never seen the fucking an image or Photoshop with S to F? Fat saver, you fat cunt. What, what, how do you not know what the fuck this is? Come on. 
Put your head out of your ass, mate. It's a fucking tier list. And you got seeds from RuneScape. Come on, mate. Fastest dropped item. Acorns? Uh, likely, yeah. I drop acorns pretty hard. 400 XP for a tree. You gotta be shitting me. Worst blue ball when you get a bird's nest with a seed. Yeah. You gotta be out of your fucking mind if you think I'm growing an oak tree after level, after level like, fucking 24. Get out of here. Now, willow seeds. Willows are a bit better. Willows are better, and I will grow willows pretty much all the time because yews are harder to find. And I've been instructed specifically on the group I'm in not to grow maples outside. Banger. By the way, I've got a banger playing right now. Um, I've been instructed not to grow maples outside of the farming guild, so. Willows get C tier, because they're not the best, but they're better than fucking acorn, and I do them a lot. Onion seed S tier, I will time you out so fucking hard, cunt. I'll come. Man's a spitting image of Denzel Washington. I swear to God. Isn't De Denzel Washington black? Who's the... Me? What? Did you just compare me to... What? Isn't... I'm thinking of Denzel Washington, right? The guy that does the, uh, the, the, the Taken video, but, but not Liam Neeson, the other one. What's it called? You see this? Yeah. That's a rule. I just planted a whole farm around of maples the other day. Yeah. Um, Anubis told me specifically, maples, don't plant them outside of the, uh, only plant them inside the, the farming guild. Reason being is that maple trees, um, are used in all three farming contracts. Equalizer, that's it, yeah. So, maple trees are used in all three um, tiers of farming contracts. So, you just save them for the farming guild. And that way, if you ever get given a tree, you're more than likely always going to have a tree there ready if you're trying to reset your, your streaks or whatever, or your, your tasks. So, that's why maple trees are meant to be used. I guess that's that's sweaty sweaty farming. So, I'm going to put them C tier. Because the reason they're C tier with willows is because they give better XP and they're great. But with that logic in mind for my game style, I'm now limited and I can't fully utilize them like Nate did. He's wasting team maple trees and we should cull Nate the next time we see him in game. Going myself soon, I have gear and range level, just low confidence. Lachlan, Lachlan, you watch me do the fucking fire caves, you won't you won't have any lack of confidence, my friend. Where's the Rana going? We'll do the herbs last. Okay, what's next? What are these? Cactus, okay, they're going F tier because no one does cactus. No one does cactus. Well, there's one person in my entire life in RuneScape I've seen do cactus unironically. Okay, and that's Rakeen. That's because he's locked to the fucking desert. What else are you going to grow out there? Man on Fire is the Taken movie you were thinking of. Great fucking movie. No, it was the Equalizer. Hey man, I'm, I'm a gun. I'm not convinced you're a very bright person if you legitimately just fucking compared me to Denzel Washington. That is the black guy, right? I'm just... I want to... You literally just said I'm... I'm the, I'm, man's the spitting image of Denzel Washington. This guy right here. You just can, it's a joke? No, the, the thing is, okay, the thing is, jokes are funny. You wanted my attention? Well, you've got it. You're a cunt. You're a dumbass. What about the cactus spin for yew tree protection? No. Just use ultra compost, you'll be fine. Basically twins. Then maybe Denzel Washington's a racist. He's doing whiteface. Or blackface. Whatever it is. The one that keeps me out of Reddit's a uh, fuckhole. What are these? Kronos. Oh, I got some Kronos seeds today. They're F tier. I'm not growing that shit. They're a waste of time. What are these? We, uh, we got sh strawberries. Now, strawberries are great, okay? If you want his attention, get a play buddy. Do that. You're not only where you get my attention, you'll also get my cock hard. Think about that for a second. Alright. Strawberries here. Calling him a spin image of Denzel is an insult to blind people. That's toxic. Strawberries are good because they're they're just like sweet corn, except with more XP. I have no idea what are used for. I have no idea why you would farm them outside of just for XP. I don't know why you'd have a strawberry basket because I don't protect anything below yew tree really. Sometimes I do use if I can, but ultra compost is too good. They're getting C tier because they're more XP than uh, sweet corn. Other than that, I don't know what they're used for. Whoever uses gout tubers for farming needs to put in a mental asylum. This is gout tuber here, eh? What, why would you use this for farming? What do you do with gout tubers? Sweet corn is super light food source for what it's worth. I can't even eat sweet corn, dude. Use them agility at low level. Strawberry basket? Mm, okay. 
Use strawberries for summer pies. I'll just do hunter. What is um What what do you do with the gout tuber? Don't you just find it? Do you actually farm this shit? Do you plant it? You get untradable gout weed from using a 900 k tuber. Oh that's pretty cool. Okay. So instead of doing the quest. The helm is in the bank. Thank you very much, Nate. I'll replace it with a with a mask for you. You cook it on a stove and it's grilled sweet corn. Oh really? Okay, I didn't know that. Sorry for killing you at Barrows by accident. Don't be sorry, just be careful. Strawberry super combust? I don't think so. Gout tuber though, okay, so you get an untradable gout tuber, which is uh, gout weed, which is the um the thing for the quest. Is that why it's worth so much? Let's get better at the game instead of going the easy route. I don't even know what that means, dude. I got a bell when you weren't live. When you went live time. Awesome, thank you. Thank you for letting me know. The rectal plo the rectal prolapse is when part of your rectum slides out through your anus. You may only get the prolapse when you're having a bowel movement at first, but eventually it will be there all the time. I'm sorry, a rectal prolapse is when part of your rectum slides out through your anus. You may only get the prolapse when you're having a bowel movement at first, but then it there. What? You mean eventually you'll just permanently have part of your rectum hanging out of your anus? Thank you, Dr. Michael Mongo, for the, the daily sexual health tip. Thank you. You're very consistent. Every stream we get a daily sexual health tip, and you educate my community even further. I can't thank you enough, brother. I appreciate it. Sounds kind of, I don't know, fucking scary to me. Yeah, it does. It sounds fucked. All right, I'll try not to get a. To, I'll try not to have a rectal prolapse. Whatever the fuck, however, however the fuck that happens. Farming gout tubers is a big flex. Gout tubers S tier. I think it's hilarious. I want to see someone do it. I'm gonna do it. An Anubis, I need you to get me two gout tubers. One for the meme. One for the content. All right. Next seeds. What do we got here? Spirit tree seeds. These are fucking shit. They're getting E tier. Spirit tree seeds have two uses. They have one use. They have one use and one limited use. You trade one for a fucking seed pack. The other one is, lim you know, it runs out after you plant it. Which is just a spirit tree. They're shit. Fuck spirit trees. They're the most disappointing fucking seeds to get because you can't trade them. They're shit. Okay? I don't care what you say. Spirit tree seeds are shit. They're shit. Okay? And they're fucking retarded to protect. What do you need? Like monkey dentures and uh, uh, some nuts and, and something else? What sort of fucking demand is that? Spiritry seeds are double S tier. No, they're not. They're shit. It's important knowledge, boys. Uh, who knows? Uh, who knows? Been your might shit your own ass out of your ass. I didn't know you could do that. That's crazy. Alrighty. Monkey nuts and and chocolate or ch chocolate or something. Yeah, it's 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 fucking weird. Only two spirit tree tellies are worth getting those are player in house and farming guild. It's it's a very useless seed. It really is. Let's be honest, guys. Congratulations on fin finishing uni for good Dart Vader. Time to watch more streams. Good man. Appreciate that, dude. Congratulations. Okay. Uh, what's this? Cabbage. Yes. Cabbage goes down here with onion and potato. Uh, uh, because no one does cabbage either. Cabbage sucks. Alright, we've established that. We can move straight on from there. What are these? Apple trees. So apple trees are like oak trees, except better, because you get a bigger XP drop. I know it takes longer, but you move to apple trees ASAP. They're going A tier because they're very limited, because not long after you start doing banana trees, which are um, there. These ones are banana. And bananas are the same as apples. They're dog shit. You just move on to the next one as soon as you can. But they're nice XP. Fruit trees are a little bit different. They're, they're just in a different bracket, you know? You can leave them there if you really want the bananas. It's, uh, they're a bit better than acorns, but they're not as good as willows, just because. Willows grow faster. So both apple and banana sit in E tier. Next, we've got these. These are called woad seeds. Now, has anyone in the chat ever grown woad seeds in RuneScape? Have you ever used these seeds? There's a big reason why you don't. Like the stream if you've never grown woad seeds. If you've never, ever used woad seeds in your life, hit the like button down below. That's all you've got to do. Spirit trees are great, but um, you only plant them once. Also, the port sand spirit tree is nice because you can reach it with the cabbage port. With a cabbage teleport. Yeah. Still useless, though. 
All my homie, homies hate words. Yeah, everyone does. Banger coming up in a sec, guys. I do agree with you, though. Uh, Karanis of Ryzen. Right, what's this here? Iasaur, what the fuck is this, say? What's it? What's an I I saw? It's it's I saw I saw I saw I saw is all I I saw I I saw I I I saw. Which one's this? An email? No, it's I saw. Farming guild thing. Make sure plans die less. Sounds pointless. Where's the other pointless one? F. It's better than that one. We're gonna give it D tier. There you go. We have like protected patches all over the world. Put your valuable shit where it's protected. Put your least valuable shit where it's not protected. Use Ultra Compost. You don't need that shit. It's an eyesore for sure. That is that is guaranteed, yes. Reduce disease, okay. What's going on, Rasmus? How we doing, man? Okay, smoke a cone on stream. From Leon Heffernan. Why is there always one fucking inbred that comes to the chat? Every stream without a doubt. You have some fucking pinhead come and go, Oi, dude, smoke a cone on stream. That'd be sick, cunt. Oi, do a shooey, dude. Like, what What are you fucking doing? What do you mean, smoke a cone on stream? You're a fucking retard? Fuck you. You smoke a, smoke a cone off stream. You gotta be... You, you, the fuck, man? Come on. I don't, ha I don't have a, a Gatorade bottle. Alright, Redwood Trade. What do you guys think of the redwood tree? Out of ten, what do we give it? I give it an. Uh, I give it a. I give it a, a. I give it an F. I think redwoods are terrible. I could use some two floss to blind you. You look so cheek cheached. Uh, now this guy's not even speaking English. Um, so I think redwood is F tier. All right, now. You're probably going to be wondering why. 20k XP? I know, it's 20k XP. It's crazy, isn't it? Now look. You hear me out. Hear me out, okay? Let me let me double check my facts here before I spit them, okay? Hear me the fuck out. Alright. Alright, cool. Redwood trees are fucking F tier, 100%. These... This is why red, redwood trees are F tier, okay? I have 90... 94, 95 farming on my on my main. I've planted one redwood tree in my life. There's no fucking way I'm planting a second. Four days for 20k XP, and you're telling me that is good? Four days for 20k XP. It is F tier. You plant it once, you don't get the plus seven boo boost when you woodcut it, so you're never cutting it. You plant it once, you go, I've done the diary, I'm not doing that shit again. It, it, you just don't do it. It's four days of wasting your fucking time. <laughs> Redwood trees are a pointless plant. 20k XP, it's A tier? It's not actually, it's F tier. I don't know if you've uh, seen the fucking stream, but what I say goes. I got 9 farming before, C existed. Sounds like it was dead content unreleased, definitely. Really good XP? It's not really good XP. 20k XP in four days? How is that really good XP? A magic tree gives you, what, over almost, almost three quarters of that in one. Takes 30 seconds to clean the patch, plant it, 15 seconds? No. It's a shit seed. Redwood trees are shit. You want to know why they're shit? Tell, tell me, tell me, if redwood trees are so good, why are they dirt fucking cheap? Why is it when you get the seed, it's worth fucking nothing? You can't sell it for good money. You know why? Because it's shit. It is a shit seed. Trust me. It's crap. It is an F tier seed. 85 watching, 46 likes. Yeah, we got fake cunts in the chat. Like the stream. Don't be a dog. I've known no farming and I never bothered with redwoods. Just do a fruit tree run every day till you get 99. See? Karana's Kar Karanas of Ryzen. Thank you for subscribing to the channel four minutes ago, man. I appreciate that. You've got a big cock. I like it. Welcome to the stream. Spitting straight facts. I respect it. Just found your channel ten minutes ago, searching for it for Science Guide. Fucking top notch content. So glad I found a channel. Found the channel. Keep it up. You G C what does G C mean? Is G C gay cunt? Is that what that means? Are you having a gay cunt? The fuck does JC mean? Good cunt. I hope it's good cunt and not gay cunt, otherwise I'm gonna be in a bit of trouble for saying that, but appreciate that roll roll of son. I hope Grand Champion. Oh okay, there you go. Grand champion. Thank you. No worries, brother. Welcome to the uh welcome to the stream. Appreciate that man. There is a Discord link. I encourage you to jump in because we've got a great community here. You'll fit right in. It maybe it is gay cunt, probably. That's fucking toxic. 
<laughs> I had to ask. Make you feel welcome, boys. Let me know what's up. It's <laughs> just looking for a fight. I'm not. Well, you think because I put these guys in uh, the redwoods in F tier, I'm looking for a fight? You guys are crazy, eh? I'm an Iron Man. I plan every time. Easiest 20k ever. If this is your easiest 20k ever, you're playing the game terribly wrong. You want an easy? You want an easy and AFK? You can you can AFK motherload mine terribly and get 20k XP in an hour on mining, or you can wait four days and get 20k XP in farming and say it's good. Farming is a shit skill. Fight me? No, I support you. 15 seconds to check it, plant it. Yeah, then you walk away. Trust me, it's terrible. Now, are you, are you, do, you, do you cut your redwoods down before you uh, before you replant them? Do you get the redwood roots out of them? Seed ranking is the funniest thing I've seen. I'm not even halfway through these cunts. You guys are interrupting me with your pointless comments that aren't making any sense. Your terrible arguments. Now, what are these? Belladonna. Has anyone ever planted Belladonna? I believe these are the best chance for the pet, right? Oh, good cunt. There you go. Thank you. It's the highest tier compliment I've ever heard living in Brizzy. I don't use it lightly. I respect that, especially being someone from Brisbane. You know, you East Coast dogs. Fucking dog cunts over there in the East Coast, mate. Fucking Brizzy, I tell you, mate. I appreciate that, man. Thank you. You're a champion. Belladonna for diary? Really? I've been dropping the shit out of these seeds. Oops. It's 3k. You're Hold on. Back the fuck up. Hold up. It's 3,000 gold to clear a redwood tree. I pay 2k and it's good. So you're telling me it costs you more than 200 GP to get rid of a redwood tree. So not only is the tree shit, not only is, is the tree terrible XP and the seed worth nothing, but you have to pay 10 times as much as any other tree to clear it. And you're telling me that it's an A tier seed. You're having a fucking laugh, aren't you? Spiritual and redwood tree is best for pet chance. I believe Belladonna is, my bad, okay. I thought Belladonna was at least. Or maybe it was high for pet chance. Belladonna trash, it fucking stabs you if you pick it without gloves. I've never done Belladonna. Oh, you have to do a drainer, don't you? Okay, it's getting E tier because it has one use. Which is one more than Redwood. I got pet from Redwood. Hey, GZ. I got phone pet at 6 farming, so I'm done, right? Yeah, pretty much. You got your pet planting of cactus? Hey, GZ. Crystal. Crystal tree. What do you guys think of crystal trees? Nightshade is useful, though. For what? Belladonna is probably better because you can harvest the faster redwoods and spirits, yeah. So crystal trees, I like crystal trees. I think crystal trees are great, great trees. They're content. It's free shards. Uh, you get them from... The, in fact, crystal acorns are the only time you don't make profit on the crystal chest if you already had the shards. If you if you buy keys and farm shards, open the enhanced crystal chest, this is the only time you don't make profit, but you get free shards. I think um, they get to go A tier. A tier because they're untradeable and you get nothing else out of them. Although being untradeable makes them better, I think, in a way. But you don't get anything else out of them. Um, but I, I, I don't think they're S tier. I think they're A tier. I think they're A tier. No, no, I'm fine. We're never playing the Crystal Tree. If you ever get Crystal Acorn, do it. It's good. It's it's mainly for the shards more than the XP. Although it is good XP. What are these? The papaya. Yes, I like papayas. Papayas are good. Papayas are getting A tier. They're very good. I like papayas. No, we don't need to discuss it. They're just A tier. Mushroom Spore. So as far as I know, Mushroom Spore is for a diary. And that's it. So that's going E. Agreed? Free energy potions? Where? What's free energy potions? What? Mushroom Spores? What do you mean free energy? Like a Mushroom Spores? Do you get more my fungus out of Mushroom Spores? Got my tangaroo harvesting a papaya tree. Nice, GZ. Well done. Papaya fruit is free energy. Is it? The fuck's papaya got to do with it? Papaya doesn't restore energy, does it? I didn't know they restored energy. I've never eaten them. I use them for protection. Gives 10 energy. Oh shit, I didn't know that. God damn. Super similar. Thanks for the 10 bucks, mate. Appreciate that. Thank you. Fucking legend. Thank you very much. Nice cock. Okay. Dwellberry. Yeah, they're useless. They're going in E because you can just get them for free. And uh, Jenga Berry, they're useless because I don't think you use them for anything past like one task. They're E. White Berries. White Berries are A tier seeds because they are super necessary. What the? Thank you, Super Simulator, for the 10 bucks, mate. Appreciate it. Um, 
let's uh yeah this the the white white berry seeds are very good the reason white berry seeds are good is because it's free white berries you don't have to plant them more than once every time you teleport to the argen schmugen hugen duga hugabuga duga monastery you just grab your seeds that you need and you send it same thing for the chronicle at the champions guild and um there's another fucking one somewhere farming guild free white berry seeds it's because they are white yeah it's definitely it, yeah it's because they're white yeah uh, but mostly because it's it's free free white berries outside a house portal in Remy. Oh yeah, that's another one too. I should plant those. But then you got poison ivy berries. Um, I can't think of a single use for these past one potion, which I doubt we fucking make. It might be Iron Man content. Stop storming your uh, fire cape. No one cares about seeds. Uh, guys, what do you think? Is Cynix eight correct? Is this random cunt that no one fucking likes or that no one fucking asked while they came to the chat? You guys don't care about this tier list. What do you think? Do we time him out or can or, or do we agree with him? Is this a 12 hour stream, a seed stream? No. No, play body, no opinion. I agree. Shut up, Cynic. Sort out your gray your shit gray name. If he donates hundred dollars right now, he can stay. I agree. You, you got uh, five minutes to think about your decision. Where is that cunt? Where is he here? You got five minutes. Think about it. Send me a hundred bucks and you can stay. If not, you can get fucked. Alright. Back to business. Everyone's having fun. Man, that cunt's weird, eh? Alright, poison ivy berries. I don't I can't remember why you would use them. I wouldn't. So I'm, I'm gonna put them E tier as well. Just because these are seeds that are fucking shit. And these have like one one use. Seeds are good content. Anyone can get a fire cape, very true. What's going on here? We're doing a fucking tier list cunt. Alright. Now, pineapple. Pineapples are very good. Because they're good XP. Uh that's it. So they get C tier. I think that's a fair argument. They're good XP. Poison over for cow crap payment. Oh, do you? Uh. Okay, I'll make them D tier. Maybe I should do some then. Didn't know that. <coughs> Super compost. Uh, for pineapple, yeah, I just use watermelons. Gautuber on S? Yeah, of course. Alright. What do we got here? Watermelon. There you go. Watermelon. Uh, B tier seeds. Watermelon are good. Watermelon are fun. Everyone does watermelon. All my homies love, love watermelon. All right. Watermelon is good. You use them for super compost, and then you turn them into ultra compost very quickly. So uh, there's no debating. Watermelon's good. What tier is the human seed? Uh, F. I'm actually uh, going to be heading to sleep real soon, but nice that you all like my commentary. Karanis of Ryzen, I enjoyed your uh, your short time here, dude. Make sure you jump on that Discord. I want to see you back in the stream sometime. I'd love to have you around here more, dude. Look after yourself, man. Alright. So, Snakegrass is new watermelon. I agree. But I think watermelon is still B tier. It's still very good and a lot more common than Snakegrass. So, if you wanted Snakegrass, I would make that A tier. Because Snakegrass is just like... The fact that you can find that now is, is, is broken. It's broken. Which I check out Discord later. Good man. It's in the description if you are interested. Discord.gg slash big dick energy. You won't miss it. Orange seeds. Sorry, let me just put those in uh, E tier. They belong with apple and bananas. Oranges are useless. I hate watermelons. Seen it too much at Corp. Why the fuck would you see it at Corp? Human seed equals cum to S tier. Yeah, good call actually. My bad. Uh, Celestra seed. Are these the ones that make you battle staffs? That's what these are, right? Celestris? They're kind of fucking useless, hey? Because, like... What... It's good XP. It grows once a day. And you get, what? Between three and nine battle stars? One day for 12k Celestris tree, yeah? Plus three battle stars? Yeah, but it's not like the Varrock battle stars you go buy. It's like... It's, a, it's, a, it's like three to nine battle stars. It's not very good. It's not dog shit, but it's not fucking bananas. Like, it's probably a D, maybe C tier tree. May I think we're being generous by making it C tier. We're gonna be generous there. There's one spot you can fucking grow them. One fucking spot. Better than magic? Um, yes, but you can do like six magic trees where you can only do one fucking Celestris tree. So, you know, fuck that. You know, there's only one spot you can plant them. Which is shit. Hespori. Hespori is always S tier. There's no debating it. There's no questioning it. Hespori is S tier. Some of the best content in the game is Hespori. It's the only reason farming is actually fucking bearable for once. Right? So Hespori can be S tier. 
Never done Hispori? Then you haven't experienced the best part of farming. Atlas, uh, Atus. What are Atus seeds? What the fuck is this? As, a, Atus, which one's that one? So we've got the one that, um, a chance of going quicker, a chance of not dying. And this one's increased yield, yeah? Increases yield. So that's the one you want to use. What do we got? We got Fuckface there. Where's the other useless one? Oh, these two. No. One's there. I saw it. That's going down to E because Atas is coming in to B because we want increased yield. All right. I'd say A. Yep. But I'm putting it in B. But I appreciate your say there, Easto. It has been considered. No, no, Hispori. And you call yourself a gamer. Yeah, it's terrible. You got to do Hispori. It's good. Never had a Hispori seed? I just keep farming. You'll eventually get them randomly. I've got like nine or eight now on my main. On my uh, group I man, sorry. Potato Cactus. Potato Cactus. Where do I put normal cactus? In F. Potato Cactus gets to go uh, D. No. Is Potato Cactus... Can that go in any cactus spot or only in a Potato Cactus spot? Where does that go? Potato Cactus is fast, good, and need for herbal. Yeah, but is it Potato Cactus for... Any cactus. Okay, it can go C then. Alright. Because I thought there was only one spot. Alright, that's pretty good then. Uh, do you do group Iron Man vids also of your progress? I was for a bit, but I lost interest in making them because... Um, the I've, It'd be easier if I didn't stream every day. Basically, my streams are my uh, group Iron Man progress. I can kind of do little updates if you want. But there's not a whole lot that I... I've got... I, 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 I don't know. I feel like I overwhelm myself too much with them. White Lily should be in at least A tier. Well, White Lily is in, um, it's in D tier. 100% protecting snake grass is OP. Yeah? I just use that core end. I don't feel the need to farm a ridiculous amount of snake grass, I guess, at the moment. I feel you. I like, uh, I like your chat comments in the vids. I appreciate that, man. Thank you. I'll try to keep them up a bit more. I've got a few different ideas I'm trying to push out at the moment slowly, so I'm just doing all these meme shorts in the meme time. Alright. Um, what are these? Seaweed spores. Giant seaweed. So these are A tier. The only reason they're not S tier is because they're fucking cunts to get. If they were if they were easier to get, I'd make them S tier, but that would also, you know, ruin it a bit. But it wouldn't matter for Iron Man. Can give you 100% protection anyway from 100% favor? Yes. So it's just there. That's why I do snake grass there. I don't plant white lilies there. It's pointless. Can't get just stand there and they spawn for free. Yeah, I don't have time to stand there, dude. I've got gains. I've got things to do. That's why they're A tier. Now, what is this? Cadaver berry. That's F tier. No one does that shit. I think we can agree on that. Like the stream if you never planted cadaver berries. Same for our red berries. Never done that unless you're an ultimate Iron Man. No, even then you wouldn't. So they're all useless. What, this, what does this leave us with? We've got... Tomatoes? Oh, sorry. Tomatoes are F tier. Sorry, guys. I missed a few seeds here. That's all F tier. There's no need to discuss F tier. We know their shit. It's fun to drop spore seeds in front of irons. Yeah, that sounds toxic as fuck. If it has berries in the name, it's dead content. Except white berry. Now, dragon fruit. Where do you guys rate dragon fruit? For me, dragon fruit is A tier. Because they're just like papayas, but better. Because they're worth more. They protect the higher shit. And they're good. Become the new Theoratrix, or however the fuck you spell his name. Why would you want me to be the new Theoratrix? Why not Why not be better than Theoratrix? I like standing on Demolagulas and dropping Xenites in front of Iron Man. That is fucking toxic. I hope you DC one day. I think I think Dragon Fruit goes A. Cow Huat Seed? Now, where, where do we put Cow Huat? Because you can only plant this once, and you get, like, fucking kegs from them, which... Don't matter. No one uses kegs. Um, unless you're an Iron Man, I guess. And, uh... They're just weird. Like, what's the point in this tree? There's, there's 600 GP for a seed. You can use Dragon Fruits to insta-charge Dragon Fire Shields. Excuse me? I did not know that. That's fucking sick. Pet chance only on, on, on them, I think. Yeah, these are going um, E tier. I will plant them once a, once in the blue moon, but that's it. I won't really do them unironically. I think I think they're E tier. They're very, very useless beyond an XP drop. 
Only the Warden of Shield, um, though since Worm, oh, uh, Wyvern, sorry. Charge with Numula. Okay, interesting. I didn't know you could use uh, Dragon Fruits to charge a shield. That's pretty cool. Now, Palm Tree. These give us Coconuts. Now, Coconuts are up there with Papaya and Dragon Fruit. Very good. These are all very good, very good seeds to be doing. Yew Trees will also sit at A, along with Magic Trees too. These are all very good trees. These are all like, yeah, i got to plant that shit. This, this is shit that should be planted when you get it, 100%. I think we can all agree on that. That's very fair. Must be planted. You would never drop it. There's value in them. They're worth doing. I think that's a, a fair statement to make. You would never question it. Um, papaya, maybe not once you've got palm and dragon fruit. Same with you, but you still would. Can Marigold get sent to the bin? F Where's Marigold? Oh, that's there? Yeah, Marigold is a hard F tier. That's, yeah, they're fucking useless. Coconuts are a pain because you need 20 coconuts per magic tree, but only get six per harvest. So if you're an Iron Man, sit. Um, go do some Kurask. If you're a main, buy them. Gautuber, why S tier? It's, it's an S tier seed. What do you mean? Gothics is in the chat, guys. Gautubers are great food. Uh, not only do they heal as much as lobsters, they also restore 50 run and make people upset when you eat them. Yeah, I want to get a bunch of Gautubers one day and just meme it. Alright, mahogany trees. The last of the trees. These are... Um, where's teaks? Teaks are B tier. Mahogany is... Hmm. Mahogany is... Are they F or are they E? I'm thinking F tier. The mahogany might be F tier seeds. Maybe E. Maybe... I think mahogany is E tier. I think mahogany is an E tier tree. I think that's fair. F, the patch location sucks. Um, kind of, yeah, but it's more about, like, growing 25 million, million, million hops per mahog is not nice. Yeah, I would never, I would only ever use Ultra Compass to protect them. I would never pay to protect them. That's crazy. E tier just because they're so cheap. I think E tier because they are, they can be planted in more than one patch, and they aren't 2k to fucking cut down once they're grown. I think E tier for mahogany is, is fair. They can stay there. Now we've got a bunch of hops here. Now all hops are mm, B tier seeds. No, wild blood. Is that wild blood? Wild blood can be A tier. But all hops are B tier. Okay? Now the reason I say that is because you don't plant them. You use them for birdhouses. And I'm a big fan of birdhouses. This is an unbiased opinion, by the way. Does unbiased mean fair? Not, not using my opinion? Whatever it is, We're, like I'm a judge in a court. So B for birdhouses, yes, because uh, the birdhouses are awesome. I fell in love with birdhouses. So um, that's what you would do. Um, and wild blood because it takes less, so easy. You're dealing in the hops are nice for protecting mahogany trees too. You're, no, you're not doing that, no. You're nearly in hops are going B because there's retards in the game that will legitimately use them for farming, so. Thank you for anyone who farms you nearly and hops in the game. You've ruined them for everyone else. Fuck you. Wild Blood S tier for Birdhouse. All other hops F tier dead content. I think you might be a fucking retard, dude. Carquette should be a tier higher due to farming XP gained alone. No, that's the only reason it's not F, is because of the farming XP. Any dead mahogany trees, like 10k XP missed. Yeah, over like three fucking days. Who gives a shit? Two stroke tire, what's up, brother? How we doing? Did you just say mud blood in the chat? 47k XP in 20 seconds. What the fuck? Well, oh, with mahogany? Yeah, it's it's definitely 47k XP in 20 seconds. I wish that was the fucking case. You know you gotta wait three fucking days before that 47k XP comes to life? No. You guys think about farming the wrong way. If you assume that, oh, this is 20 seconds for 47k XP when you do farming. You're, you're calculating it completely fucking wrong. The clock starts the second you put it in the ground. It's not very good XP. Limpwort roots. I forgot about these. Uh, these are B tier. Limpworts are very good. I'd imagine late game not too bad, but Iron Man, they're very good. It's meant to be passive. They're fucking E tier. Alright, what I say goes. You have no debate. Now, we've got a bunch of herb seeds at the end here now, guys. So, this is where it's going to get debatable. Which herb seeds are the best to do? We're going to start with um, Guam Leaf. 
Where's Guam? Which one's that? This one here. Guam? F tier. No one does Guam. Alright. Marin 2. Marin 2 is a... Uh... Marin 2 we're going to put A tier. Because anti-poisons are important early on. Marin 2 is used for... Um, I, I think Guam might be as well, right? But Marin 2 is used for Guthix Rest. And um, they're better than Guam's. Okay? What tier would you put the farming game at? The highest seed of content. The farming game? As in like doing farming in general? F. Just because it's passive doesn't mean the time didn't happen. Just means it's crap. True. Marantil for Gilded Altar. Yeah, Marantil's got his... Guam is also used for Gothic Rest. Is it? Okay. We can put that in A. -A. We'll put it in A, okay? Because uh, like from an Iron Man's perspective where you can't just go fucking buying it, the whole purpose of farming them is for like the, the herbs to be used later. I heard Theoratrix was caught in public sacking off while on a heavy dose of bath salts. Is there any, like, you know, do you just wake up one day and just think, I'm going to comment some fucking ignorant dumb shit on a, on a stream where it has completely no relevance? Like, were you expecting me to laugh at that? Was, was, who gives a fuck? <laughs> yeah, tag pots from Warriors Guild for dirt cheap. F tier is right. I think E tier is fair. Now, where's Taraman? Taraman is, uh, Taraman is F tier. Taraman is a fucking stupid herb. It's one of the worst herbs in the game. Taraman is dog shit. So Taraman can go F tier, okay? That's for sure. Highlander, however, is a little bit of a different story. Highlander gets an upgrade to C tier. It's a rather useful herb, and when you don't have uh, staminas, this is your, they're your friend. Irrit legit triggers me. Really, I like Irrits. We're up to Ranar. Now, Ranar is a questionable herb. Now, a lot of people value Ranars highly because obviously, oh my god, Ranars are worth so much money. Prayer pots, I'm a dickhead. Yes. Um, Ranars have one use, and that is prayer potions. They're going B tier because prayer potions are top tier. No, Ranars are going C tier. No, Ranars are going D tier. Ranars are D tier, okay? 100%. Ranar weed is D tier. Ranar seed is D tier, okay? I've thought about it. I've, I've thought about it long and hard, and I think it's now D tier. I wrote a guy for Theatrics. Not a bad dude. Just had a fucking meltdown on Twitter, but so do most of the fuckheads on Twitter. Yes, indeed. Okay. Ranar weed gets D tier. Yes, weed. Very good. Very fun. Um... But yeah, it, other than that, it's sitting in D tier. Uh, no one uses prayer potions in 2021. I use prayer potions in 2021. So the reason it's in D tier is because um, you just told me to touch a locator orb. The reason it's in D tier is because the experience you get from it is fucking horse shit. They don't give any XP. You need to have a if, even if you want a good XP, then you need a reasonably high farming level to make it worth your fucking while. Yes, they're profitable on a main. But there's way better fucking methods out there. Ran Ranar weed is is the seeds are too rare for what they're worth. Once they're, they're they're dead content in the late game, they're just shit. They really are shit past a certain point. Yes, prayer potions are the bee's knees. Yes, but this isn't a prayer potion tier list. This is a Ranar seed tier list. They are rare pieces of shit. I actually like fucking hate having Ranar seeds because now I have to go shit. I don't want these to die because I need them. But why do I need them? Why do I need them when irrits are more valuable? Irrits are more valuable because they give me fucking super attack potions, which I will use more often. And I get more often. Irrits are fucking top tier. They're B. You can, you can literally like fucking... You find Irrit seeds under every fucking rock. Renar seed S tier, please. From Barry Savalo for five pounds. You know what? For five pounds, I think I can, I can, I can change my mind and put Renar up in S tier for you. Fine. I don't agree. But for five pounds, I think I can do that. Yes, I'm a sellout. So what? 80% of how streaming works. Avento is more probable than Renner, yes. Make a tier list for every tree to chop in RuneScape. I think I already have. I've, I've at least got one. Renner seed S tier PLSXO. So I, I think... Uh, yeah. No more discussing the Renner then. It's it's in S tier. There you go. But Irrit is B tier. They're common. They're easy. They're great XP. It's like 100 fucking XP per attack potion. 112 XP per super anti-poison. Irrits are great. Irrits are great. Toad flax. Now, toad flaxes, these are some, that's some fucking E tier dog shit right there. Alright. Toad flaxes are actually the best percentage wise profitable seed in the game. 
Okay, if you are a non Iron Man, Toad Flax, you will spend like 30 GP and you will make bank. Or whatever they're fucking worth. Toad Flaxes are the, the best um, the best seed 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 for seed for money that yeah, it's so popular. Yes, they are, yes. Toad Flax is a uh, Sarabrews, yes, they are Sarabrews, okay? My bird houses, uh, you've got a lot of birds nests. Yes, I do. So the reason Toad Flax is E tier is because all they're doing until you're level 81 uh, herb law is toad flaxes are sitting in your bank. So it's almost no point fucking farming. They just sit there. They're useless for almost fucking 30% of your herb law growth. For 80% 80, 80 of your fucking gameplay, they're useless. Hell, 80% of you fucking retards in this game don't even go past 76 or 78 herb law, whatever it is, for Chambers of Zarek. Let's be honest, a lot of you guys playing this game are fucking retarded. You don't go past whatever the max herbal level is required for Chambers of Zarek, that you don't even get the chance to make Super uh, Sarah Bruce, so it's not an argument to say Toe Flax is worth your fucking time. Let's be honest here. Let's let's not fucking... Let's not paint it a different colour than what it is. 90 is for Cox, yes, but everyone goes, Oh, you can just do these rooms, and then you don't need 90 for Cox. Alright? You don't, like, let's be honest, a lot of the retards in this game won't touch it. Probably wouldn't have got 90 Herb if it wasn't for your peer pressure me. Exactly, Tanya. People become better players when they come to my content, when they come to my stream, when they support your fucking boy. You become better players. And I hit a hard fucking criteria in the RuneScape community because I'm not down with standing in front of Theatre of Blood Bank trying to measure my cock with anyone thinking KCs are what define me as a player. So, since my community is on the smaller but more edgier side of the content creator platform, we can all agree that a lot of people out there are dog shit at the game. 44 Herb Lord Gang, that's not a flex. Trust me. It's, it's not a flex to... It, you know what that's the equivalent to? Saying 44 Herb Lord Gang is equivalent to having a sticker on the fucking back of your car that says, My son, or I, my superpower is loving a child with autism. That is exactly what that fucking flex is right there, Mr. Green's mean green bean machines. Play the fucking game. I am, uh, Chris McCabe says, King Condor, I am new to your vids. So far, pretty epic. Resemblance to Aussie Man, who is also epic. We'll get on your Discord later too. Can't wait to see a group Iron Man fire Kate run. Can't, you have no idea how offensive that is, that comment. I appreciate your, your honesty, and I can tell you're coming from a nice place. But, um, as an Australian, let me tell you right now, as an Australian myself, and any other Australian in the chat will confirm, Aussie Man Reviews is a degenerate piece of shit. Please do not compare me or any other Australian to Aussie Man Reviews. Inside of Australia... He's nothing but a fucking dead weight, but I appreciate it nonetheless. As you're not Australian, I'd assume that you, that comes from a good place, so thank you. Thank you for uh, jumping in the Discord in the future, and I look forward to doing the Firecat run too. Alright. Sorry, back to business after my little rant there. Let me, let me just fucking... Alright. After my little rant, let's move on. Toad Flax, I think I've painted the image pretty well. Avento. Avento seeds are... We're going to make them C tier. Now, this is coming, again, from an Iron Man's perspective, um, which some of you might not relate to, but the the, it, the difference between raiding a seed like this and then raiding it on a main is that a main can just buy the fucking Avento. You buy the potion, even. Aventos are kind of fucking weird because they're great XP, but it sucks getting the mushrooms for them. So, I, uh... I'm, uh... Yeah, I'm not looking forward to that grind for, for stamina potions. So that's why they're C tier. They're C tier because everything else about them sucks. That's pretty much it. Level 1 anything but defense isn't a pure, it's a noob. And being a pure isn't being a noob. I'm new to your vids. So far, pretty epic. Resemblance to Steve Owen is also epic. <laughs> we'll get Discord later too. Can't wait to see a group I'm in 5k run. Thank you, Daniel Gallagher, you fucking cunt. You're a dickhead, eh? <laughs> I'm a RuneCraft and Herblore level 1 pure. You cringe, that's what you are. Quam, Quam. Now, I like Quam. Quam is good. Quam is A tier seeds. Okay? They're very important seeds. They're very good XP. They're starting to, we're starting to push the barrier of uh, what, what a good seed really is. And that is Quam. Quam seeds are good. Alright, guys? So, it, regardless of profit, good seeds to be planting. Aventon and Lathentine, kind of the same. Yeah, Lathentine. Oh, we got Snapdragon next. Snapdragon is going to go B tier. Okay, the reason Snapdragon's going B tier is because, uh, where'd the Ranar go? Where's Ranar? Oh, right, yeah, that cunt put in S tier, didn't he, the fucker. Fuck you. Snapdragon's B tier because they're, they're like Ranars, but better in almost every fucking way. 
Except still just as rare, but they kind of have a better excuse to be that little bit rarer, you know? You sound just like Ozzy Man? I really don't. I promise I don't. Well, my fungus super quick to get with Draken's Medallion. <laughs> yes. Message received when I was trained. That's okay, Chris McCabe. Don't take it personally. I appreciate it, man. Welcome to the stream. Welcome to the content. Next. Catentine. Does anyone really use these? Oh, they're super defenses. Yeah, they're okay. Yeah, no, they're good. They can go B C tier. They can go C tier. Okay, super defenses are on the one of the most useless super pots, I guess. No one does defense, do they? We don't. We don't do defense. You know, defense potions are a fight on site. Super defense is mostly there for uh, super combats. That's the main purpose to do cat and time. You're not going to do it for XP because there's better alternatives. They're kind of a they're a dead weight herb waiting for the end game of herb lore. Dead weight seed waiting for the end game of uh, farming. That's pretty much it. I'm new to your vids. So far, pretty epic resemblance to Rolf Harris. Isn't that kind of pedophile? Who is also epic? Epic. Sorry, epic. Did you just say? Isn't Rolf had it? Isn't that a pedophile? Can't. Lantodine is an A tier seed. Because the herbs are fucking useless. Did not expect to become a meme. Yep, well, you fucked me now. <laughs> I'm pretty sure this country's compared me to a pedophile happily. Safe shocking Anthony, voice of the people. It's always the grey names too. No plate body and they're all fucking they rip my asshole in half. You don't like the antifires? What the fuck is your antifires? Do they or do these give you antifires? Lantodine. What sort of antifires do they give? Or is it Catatine Cat that was land? Do they do just normal anti-fire? Or do they do super anti-fire? Extended anti-fire? I'm near your vids. So far pretty epic. Resemblance to Big Les, who's also epic. I respect that. Now that's a comment. That's a comment right there. Thank you. We're getting Discord loaded too. Can't wait to see group Iron Man Fire Cape run. Thank you, Barry Savaloy. Appreciate it. How do I get a plate body? You become a channel member. It's like a Twitch sub. But it's 80% cheaper with 90% more content. There should be a join button down below or a link in the description that says join the naughty boys. Be careful though because Reddit has labelled me as a greedy and racist uh, streamer. So by having a plate body, you are certified uh, you are certified racist. But don't worry, there's 820 plus of us here supporting that cause and no one gives a fuck about Reddit. So it's not bad for one US dollar a month. All of them if you had the right stuff. Okay. I, I didn't know they did antifires. Only antifires you can use until 84 herb. Fine, that's a fair argument. Normally I don't take arguments from the chat, but I will allow it. We can make it D tier. How about that? For antifires. Now we're left with two seeds. The Torstol seed and the Dwarfweed seed. Does anyone want to take a guess at where these two might be going? Chat, I'll let you guess. And if anyone gets it right... Well, I'll just say, yep. I haven't got anything for you because I couldn't give a fuck. Lander for ranging pots. It's just, yeah, okay, fine. It's D tier. Right, I'm leaving it D tier. Dwarf weed for ranging pots. Yeah, that's, yeah, not lanterns. Dwarf weed for so. Shit tier, you reckon? Dwarf weed for B tier. Dwarf weed, I'm actually going to put in S tier. Okay. Fuck one of Zami, D tier, dwarf weed. Okay. Torstol, E tier. I think Torstol deserves to be B tier along with Snapdragons, I think. Or do they get, no, nah, Torstol gets to be A tier, I think. What's this one? That's Quam. I'm gonna put Quam and B and Torstall on A, I think. Saying all Australian sounds like like Aussie man is racist. Yeah, I guess so. I, th I think that's fair. Dwarf weed on a main is big bones. If you don't plant dwarf weed, unironically, you might be a bit retarded, but don't worry, that's why they call me the king. I'm gonna educate you and tell you why. Okay? So Quam's actually going down to B tier because it actually makes a lot more sense um, in my mind. Tall Stars are A tier because you pretty much plant them all the time. They're great. Kind of shit because it's really late game for Iron Man. That's okay. When you get them, you always plant them. You don't do anything but plant Tall Stars. You just save them. Now, Dwarf Weed. You guys are gonna you guys are gonna learn something today. Dwarf Weed is some of the best fucking farming XP in the game. And I'm not very educated in farming, so this might be complete horseshit. But if you're doing herb runs and you've got anything but Tall Stars, this is what my this is my advice to you. Okay? Regardless of gender, my advice is all your safe, you got how many safe farming spots are there, herb patches? You've got the, the two trial ones, you've got the Hosidius one, or any other farming spots for herbs safe. There's, there's three safe patches and nine patches in total, right? 
Condor, I'm new to your vids. So far, uh, so far, pretty epic. Resemblance to Chris Hansen, who is also epic. Who the fuck is Chris Hansen? Am I, is... Who the fuck's Chris Hansen? What sort of fucking head is that? Is this another pedophile? Oh, it's to catch to catch a predator to catch a predator host. Huh. Fuck you. He catches pedophiles. All right. To to catch a pred. Okay, makes sense. Condom Ninja vid so pretty epic. Resemblance to Chopper, who is also epic. True. Thank you. I appreciate that. Okay. All right. All right. Very cool. Thank you guys. I appreciate it. It's a good meme. Very funny. All right. So. <laughs> Look at South Park Chris Hansen. I, I might not do that right now, but I'll do it after. Uh, Guam and B tier for Big Dick Energy. Okay, fine. Thank you for the, the two euros there, Taggle Brick. Um, regardless of my opinion, which is the only way we should be doing this tier list, I am, of course, a streamer and therefore a sellout. And I will happily put Guam's at B tier because you paid for it. Thank you. Regardless of opinion. If you were a boss, you would be Galvec. Because I'm, for some reason, difficult to defeat. Thank you for the 69 likes. Very nice, guys. Don't forget to like the stream unless you got a small cock. What now, the? I'm pretty sure... Guam in B tier for Big D Energy. Thank you very much. I'm pretty sure, if my math is correct, you've got nine herb patches in the game. Three of them are safe. Six of them are not safe. Okay? You use Ultra Compost. The three safe ones, that's where you do your Torstoles, Rana, and, and Snapdragon, okay? Your most valuable seeds go on those three. Torstol, Rana... And a Snapdragon. Do those in your three safe patches. The other six, you should be doing Dwarf Weed Seeds. Now you might think, oh, but I don't need Dwarf Weed Seeds. Oh, I'm a dickhead. Oh, my brain is uh, mush and my penis goes inwards. Yes, I know, right? Suck my cock. I get it. But the amount of XP you get from farming Dwarf Weed is fucking amazing. It's a huge XP for farming. A huge XP boost. There's, the herbs are very useful for training Herblore as well. There is so much XP inside Dwarf Weeds. Uh, and, and the seeds are less than a thousand GP. They're like 700 GP seeds. Almost 200 XP per pop. Uh, a pop, yes. And they're, they're like 700 GP a seed. Plant those fuckers in those six patches. That way if they die, it doesn't matter because it's just 600, uh, 700 GP down the drain. Does not matter. Alright? And if it's good, you get bank XP. So it's just free XP for herb farming. It's faster XP than your fucking four-day Redwoods. Oh, do that once every four days. It's free 20k XP in 20 seconds. It's not. Okay? Dwarf weed seeds are top-tier seeds. And they are underrated and should be utilized because they're fucking cheap. Okay? It's another one of those things where they're only cheap because no one understands the potential of them. Dwarf weed seeds, top tier. That's going to wrap up the tier list there. I'm now going to do a quick summary. Okay? If you were an OSRS boss, you'd be Glod, you dickhead. Who's Glod? Stanford Wheels and Tires Australia? Is Glod the, the, the Grim Tales cunt? Because that guy's badass and the music they have is the best song in RuneScape. Now, it's also probably because I'm six foot eight, I assume. Back to the uh, the, the summary of the, the tier list. Okay, I'm going to wrap this up here. If you have uh, skip ahead in the video to the timestamp right here, all I just want to say is fuck you. I'm going to do the rest of this video of adverts. For everyone else in the stream, thank you for sticking by. This is what's going to happen, alright? We're going to go through the summary right now, and then we're going to get a fire cape. Starting off with F tier, you've got potato, onion, nas, 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 nastru, nasturitium, 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 what was it? Nasturitium, nasturitium, nat, nat, nas, nasty, nas, nasturitium. Nasturitium? Nasturitium. Nas Nasturitium. What was it? Nastandese nuts. The Nastandese nut seeds. Acorns. Uh, you got cactus. You got... <laughs> you got cronos. You got cabbage. You got woad leaves. Redwood trees. Uh, what are these things? Cadaver berries. Redwood berries. Tomato seeds. Uh, taramin seeds. And marigold. Are all F tier seeds because they're dog shit. You drop them on the floor as soon as you find them. Or sell them if you're a redwood cunt. E tier. Now, these, uh, anything in the E tier seed pretty much have one use in this game, and that is to literally 
use it and never fucking touch it again as soon as you can, which is like spirits trees. There's only one decent spirit tree location in the game, and that is your house. People will say the farming guild, but um, Dragonstone jewelry exists, so shut the fuck up. Curry trees, you only use them just to get by. You know, apple, banana, and orange are really just as well just to get by. You don't really... When have you ever made a fucking curry in RuneScape? You haven't, Getting okay? Let's be honest. Like Hurricane season. Hurricane season. Welcome to the channel membership, my friend. Thank you. You're a champion. Nice cock. Not bad. I, I respect that heavily. Thank you. Uh, we've got Belladonna seeds. you got Dwellberry seeds. you got Jango Berry. What, the, what is this? I saw. I, I saw. Mahogany. Marantil and Toad Flax Seeds are all E tier because they're just all, they're not really worth your fucking time doing. They're not. They're dog shit. Okay, they all are. Toad Flax is only worth your time late game. And um, a lot of the time, no. You're doing, you're doing raids by then, you're getting your own Toad Flax. It doesn't matter. Why play around house because construction cave exists? You, you say that like everyone in this game doesn't like actively just sit at 83 construction because that's all you need for this game. People will milk the shit out of these skills and this con in, in content in this game as much as they fucking can. It's not a fair argument. The disrespect for the redwood trees send is too much. The redwood trees are dog shit. It's a fact. I'm sorry. This isn't... You're not here to, to have a good time. You're here to fucking learn. D tier. Now, you're nearly in... You're, sorry. You're nearly in seeds are D tier. Normally, all hops would not be D tier. They're all B tier. But you're nearly in seeds are D tier because there's retards in this game that legitimately plant them and have ruined it for everyone else. So, if you plant your nearly in hops un, unironically, you need a bullet. And then you got White Lily, because uh, I don't see a use for White Lily other than changing Groot. Sweet Corn, because they have one use, and that's because you don't have anything else to plant. An allotment. Poison Ivy Berry it has one use, which is for Cow Huat protection. And then Lat Latodime is because it's just kind of a dead herb, let's be honest. C tier, you've got Maple. Maple is uh, basically trees to get by. I've been instructed personally to not plant them unless it's inside the farming guild, because that get way... fucking done. Like a chain. <laughs> Chris McCabe, thank you. Welcome to the channel membership, brother. I appreciate that. You're a champion. Nice plate, buddy. You and Hurricane Season. Wear them with pride. You got nice cocks. Not bad for one US dollar a month, my friend. Thank you. Appreciate that, guys. You're champions. Uh, the, sorry, the maple trees. I've been instructed not to plant them outside the farming guild because they're using all three contracts. Kind of a, a dead tree for me at that point. Now, you've got pineapple and uh, strawberry. Now, these are just things you plant, again, because you've got them that are better than anything before it. You, you're trying to gap levels with those trees. You've got potato cactus, which is used very rarely. You really only do them at the farming guild, let's be honest. I know you can plant them elsewhere, but you don't go to fucking the desert for the cactus. You don't. What's the point? Uh, Celestris, it would be better if you could plant it in more than one fucking spot. You've got Avento, Highlander, and Catatine seeds. These you plant if you have time. If you've got nothing else to plant, you plant them. You don't rate contracts? I don't think contracts are super important. They are, but they're also, like, they're limited to the guild, so they're only really useful inside the guild, where farming is all around the world, isn't it? Right, we've got grape seeds here. Grape seeds are, uh, I've never used them, but Anubis used them to help me get my cooking up, so they're B tier. They're good. Teak trees are the only trees worth planting on Fossil Island. We know this. Atos is the only tree worth, uh, plant or seed worth using outside of a Hespori. We know this. Watermelon. They're great. The only thing better than watermelon is snake grass. There's no debating it. There's no arguing it. You've got all the hops here, other than Yanillion, of course. We discussed that. And Wild Blood. These hops are good because birdhouses. Birdhouses are top tier. Do your birdhouse runs. Don't be a dog cunt. Limport root, very important seed. Limports are just important. You should be doing them as much as you can. I do them where I can protect them because I don't want to lose them. Because they're important for Iron Man. Uh, Irrit, Quam, Snapdragon, and Guam Leaf. Now, Guam Leaf is B tier because someone paid... Two fucking euros for it to be beat here. And as a streamer, and especially as Reddit said myself here at uh, King Condor, but as a streamer, um, I'm a sellout. And uh, we all are, let's be honest. So, yeah, two two euros will get the seed to where you want it to be. So, there you go. Thank you, Taggle Brick. Guam's at B tier, you dickhead. Uh, everything else at B tier, Eric, Quan Alarm, and Snapdragon. Seed you should be doing. You should just be doing it. Snapdragon where it's protected, the other two where, where you can if you have the level. Proud sellout, Sigma Grind. So it's not about being a proud sellout. It's about just not bullshitting the audience, right? I'm not trying to pull the wool over your eyes. Let's be honest. All right? It's it's it is what it is, right? I'm not going to sit there and tell you, hey, I'm I'm really happy and I love my life when I want to throw myself off a fucking cliff and I probably will tomorrow. I'm not going to bullshit you. I'll just tell you the fucking truth. You're not here to fuck around. You're not here to get fucked. You're here to have a good time. 
So I guess you are here to get fucked, but not like Twitch. Not like getting cucked, you know? Back to business. Papaya trees. These are A tier. Papaya trees, crystal trees, snape, snape grass. What are these? White berries, dragon fruit, mushroom spores, palm trees, yew trees, magic trees, wild blood, which are for birdhouse purposes, and torstol. These seeds here, other than the wild blood, obviously, because they're for birdhouses, all the seeds in A tier are there to be planted. If you have them, you don't drop them, you don't sell them, you use them, okay? They're just, they're always great value, XP, time, and money. There's no reason why you wouldn't. I'm sure we can all agree on this. They're all great seeds. And that brings us to S tier, which are the game-changing seeds. If you get anything S tier here, you um, it, it's it's the top it's the top of the market. It's really the best way to, to play this game. And anything S tier should be taken with pride and used accordingly. First off, Hespori. Hespori is some of the best content in the game. I think we can agree with that. Hespori is in uh, one quest, which is Night at the Theater. He's in the Farming Guild and he's in Theatre of Blood. There's there's three places Hespori is on the map and only one of them is rewarding. And that's Theatre of Blood. However, this Hespori is still pretty good. It's very good XP, it takes a day to grow. And it's a bit of combat. It makes farming somewhat less fucking cunty. So, um, it's a free boss. Nothing wrong with Hespori at all. Plus, the, the, the bucket is pretty cool. Gout Tuber. Now, I didn't realize you could eat these. Apparently, you can eat these. That's hilarious. And, uh, but the real Chad mood is, uh, move is to plant it for the free gout weed. Because um, there's absolutely no reason why you fucking would. I think it's hilarious. So fucking do it. I want to I see a video of someone doing it. Or someone trade me one and I'll do it. Because that's uh, that's fucking hilarious. I didn't know you could do that till today. So they're S tier. Gout tuber is... Real men will plant their gout tubers. Cheap cunts will try to sell them. Then you've got... um. You've got Ranar Seed. Now, Ranar Seed, in my opinion, is like a D tier seed. Ranar Seed's a dog shit. But, um, once again, as a former, well, as a current streamer and sellout, um, yeah, someone paid five bucks to, to put that shit, or five, five pounds. I think it was pounds, right? He paid five something, and it was enough to put Ranar in S tier. I disagree completely. I think Ranar Seeds are fucking shit and way too fucking rare for what they're worth. You can plant the gout. Yeah, I believe you can. And then the final. S tier seed, which I'm sure we can all agree on, and I've made a very good case for, is the dwarf weed seed. The dwarf weed seed is S tier. A big five a cunt. Thank you. It was Barry Sublet. It was, yeah. It wasn't pounds, was it? It was pounds. Yes, it was. Thank you. Thank you, Barry Sublet. Anyways, the dwarf weed seed is intentionally an S tier because it's the best seed in the game. You have three safe patches and six unsafe patches of herbs. Those six patches that are not safe, you use for dwarf weed. Don't put your good seeds in them because they'll die. They will. I know of Ultra Compass, it's uh, compost, sorry, it's rare. But uh, dwarf weed seeds are worth 700 GP. Buy a bunch, plant them there because they're fucking good XP. It's free. And then your three safe ones, do your good seed, uh, do your, your Renar, Snapdragon, and Torso herbs there, the ones that you really want. Dwarf weed seeds are slept on and are very important. Help me get a 5k of my iron. I will help you by you watching me and going, nice, GZ. That's how I will help you. That is going to wrap up the, the C tier list there. That was a fat hour and 20 minutes. We're going to now go get a fire cape on the group Iron Man, and it's going to be very easy. So sit tight, stay tight, and uh, it's three minutes until it's 20 minutes past the hour, which means it's always 420 somewhere. So if you smoke weed or if you have a Gatorade bong in your house right now, start playing the Gatorade saxophone. Go smoke a comb while I get ready to uh, start sending this fire cape. Thanks for watching. For those watching this video after the stream, don't forget to suck a fucking fat one, and I'll see you later, cunt.